now that stories are all around us, books, your life, songs, even trees, they all tell their own story. Right now, the trees are telling me a story about how summer is slowly winding down and fall is just starting to creep into Michigan. What other stories do you think trees can tell us? Let's see together in Tap the Magic Tree, written and illustrated by Christy Matheson, read with permission of HarperCollins Publishers. There's magic in this bare brown tree. Tap it once. Turn the page to see. There's a leaf. Tap again. One, two, three, four. What do you think is going to happen? Now tap again even more. Tap, tap, tap. Look at all those leaves. Rub the tree to make it warm. Flowers. Touch each bud and see what forms. Look at all those flowers. Give the tree a little jiggle. That's it. They're all on the ground now. Now, make your fingers wiggle. Brush away the petals, swish, and blow the tree a tiny kiss. Apples! Shake the tree, shake, shake, shake. Plop, 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 curb, plop. Knock, knock on the tree. Then stop. The leaves have turned yellow. Pat the leaves. Be gentle, please. Aha. Now blow a whooshing breeze. Ready? Clap your hands to bring the snow. Are you ready for snow? It's coming. Okay. Be patient. Wait. Don't go. There's a bird coming to the tree. And she's built a nest. Close your eyes and count to ten. Ready? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now open your eyes. Magic! It begins again. Look at those leaves on the tree. I think nature is amazing, and trees are truly fascinating. Today, or whenever you can, I want you and your family to go out on a nature hike and see all the different things nature has to show you. Thank you for spending some time with me today. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Remember to check out my virtual library for even more of our favorite storytime activities. I'll see you again soon. Bye.